here I am with another one of my Remy's bounce pack challenges. Uh, and for this one, we're going to use washi tape, paper scraps, stickers. Oh, I didn't get my um, water soluble medium out, but that's fine. And we'll start with the washi tape. I'm going to use this brown one. Maybe another brown one that I have. So, I'm going to say what a lot of crafters have said before. I am making a pledge to not buy any more craft supplies. I have a lot of craft supplies. I have things that people have sent me and I have never used. I have supplies that I've bought and never used. I have supplies that I've bought and used a little bit. And now they're just sitting there. So, it stops now. So this sort of thing is perfect for using what you have. And that's exactly what I'm going to do from now on. And use what I have. Um, yeah, my art space is literally this table um, in my bedroom. All my supplies are here in my room. I have a very small room, it's not a big room at all. I can't, I have no more space. Um, so, and I want to make space uh, not for more supplies, I want more breathing space. I'm going to keep saying to myself every time I look at something and think, mm, I want that. I'm going to think, no, breathing space. Okay? So having said that, <laughs> before I decided this, I did order some things online. Um, which I'll probably share with you when they arrive. But they are the last things I will be buying. Definitely, definitely. Okay. So, yeah, this year it's going to be an interesting journey of just using what I have. Um, so, I'm going to use this scrapbook paper that I found while I was tidying. I found all these scraps. So, yep. They're just sitting there, waiting to be used. Beautiful patterns. Absolutely no reason not to use them, so we're using them today. Okay. Also gonna try and let go of things that I'm not using as well. That's another thing. And I have a friend who I can share things with. So when the things that I have ordered arrive, I will probably split it down and give her some duplicates because I think they are, from what I remember, they're quite big packs. And I don't need all that much, I just wanted a few for my small journal that I'm doing. So, you know, no point hanging on to things if you're not going to use it. Breathing space. <laughs> Fun, definitely using up all these things. I have a lot of um, 
things like painted papers that other people have given me and I've been kind of I don't know hoarding them because I'm afraid to use them that kind of thing and you know it's not good is it people give you these things because they want you to use them so anyway Golden, matte medium, gel medium, because they are quite heavy papers, so I need something strong. Stick them down. resolution in February <laughs> I've decided and I may even do something I don't know make a little postcard or poster or a little ATC to go in my purse I don't know just something that says something you know breathing space reminds me of why I'm not buying things I think it would be better for my help not to have all this clutter. Okay. Uh, okay, so that's some paper scraps down. Looking good already, yes. Don't you like it? Yes. Um I think I'm gonna go let's have a look for that other washi tape that I know I have. There it is, that one. Let's have a little bit more washi, just a little bit. Just to connect these. This is another thing I do not need any more of. I had to find a, another small box for my washi tape overspill. <laughs> and that is not good. I shouldn't have to have an overspill bin for my washi tape. So, yes, no more washi tape. I have plenty. I have pretty much every colour in washi tape I need or you can imagine or you know I do not need any more washi tape so that's looking good and now I'm going to go over with a coat of gesso uh, yes I am going to use white gesso Definitely. Let's grab. Oh, oh, oh. See clutter. Clutter everywhere. No more. I mean, if I run out of gesso, I'll buy more gesso. You know, essential supplies, yes. But I definitely don't need any more papers, like I said. I don't need any more stencils or stamps or dyes. I don't need it. If I don't need it, I'm not buying it. But I'm also doing the same with clothes because I have so many clothes that I don't wear. Not because I don't want to, but because I have, I just have so many clothes, so I tend to just wear the same things, even though there's stuff in my wardrobe that I can't get to, you know. 
So he stops. Clutter free mind this year. Obviously, a few things going to the charity shop. happy and support the charity at the same time don't mind that right And dipped in the gesso there. Nice. Okay. So I shall give that a bit of drying time and then dig out my water soluble crayons. We'll have some play with some colour. Uh, I don't know, maybe use some gelatos, maybe use woodies, I'm not sure. Uh, I think gelatos, I haven't used this for ages. I need to use them because I have them. If I don't use them, they're going. <laughs> okay, so, be back when that's dry. Okay, let's see, what, what colour do we want? Grey, maybe? Uh, Maybe stick to some of the lighter colours at the middle. So may still be slightly wet, but that's fine. Yes, it's wet. Loving this.
not really. So I suppose we let it dry again and then we come back with stickers and markers when we're done. Okay, so I've had a little thought. I think we just need to add a bit of depth into the background. So I've got these martyr stamps, these actually come together. So I'm gonna use the text. Just a little bit. I'm using ground espresso archival ink. There we go, that's that. And then where do I want this? I'm thinking oh yes, edges. Um if this doesn't stamp perfectly but do you want a nice impression yes Ooh. Not quite dry, but let's get this thing finished, shall we? So let me pop, just pop these away and get these moved out the way. Sorry. <laughs> So we may use some, yeah, we're going to need some glue, that's fine. Let's see what we've got. Oh, so that one. Um, what else? Uh, oh, I don't know. Just have 
place the unknown. Okay. Definitely need to start using these stickers up because they are losing their sticky. Lovely stickers, but I have had them for a very long time, so yeah. Need to start using these supplies, as I say. I'm going to make a mess on the wall. And then grab my pen. Ah, too much glue. It needs to dry. got any on this kind of coloured background. Jellyfish, no. Dragonfly. Uh, ah. So, this one. Pink in it. And we are drawn to this one, so let's have this one. the gelato as well that the pen doesn't like because they are very creamy and it is notoriously hard to write over gelatos so. I think I should leave that there. Very happy with it. Simple, 
this is what these pages are about five supplies get on with it do a page don't worry don't stress so I'm going to date it and what's today's date actually the 7th today is the 7th of the 2nd 22 there we go so thank you very much for joining me um, check out Marta's um, five supply challenges um, they are great for inspiration just forgetting you know trying to forget how to be perfect if that makes any sense not how to be perfect but stop worrying about being perfect that's what I mean <laughs> just like I say take five things and go for it I am at the moment using the same supplies as Marta but you could always just go for what supplies you have or want to use as I say I do have a lot of stuff that people have sent me over the years so I will be delving into that and I may do a five supply with five things that I dig out of my happy mail pile that would be great wouldn't it so yes thanks again for watching hope you enjoyed it and I hope you join along and have a great day bye guys